Hello dear people, welcome back. This question is from GATE 2018 exam and is for one mark. Just read the statement. It says, consider a long-lived TCP session with end-to-end -end bandwidth of 1 Gbps. It's given that 1 Gbps means 10 raised to the power 9 bits per second. The session starts with a sequence number of 1, 2, 3, 4. The minimum time in seconds rounded to the closest integer before the sequence number can be used again is. Okay. Now you very well know that TCP uses a random initial sequence number. That means first byte of data will be given a sequence number that is chosen at random. Okay. And for this question, it is 1, 2, 3, 4. So random initial sequence number is 1, 2, 3, 4. Now let us see how many total sequence numbers are available. That depends upon how many bits are there to save the sequence number. That is 32 bits. Okay. So with 32 bits, you can generate 2 raised to the power 32 combinations. Okay. So total sequence numbers are these many. They will start from sequence number 0 and they will go to sequence number 2 raised to the power 32 minus 1. So this is the range of sequence numbers that TCP uses. So random initial sequence number will be chosen from this range only. Okay. So they are saying random initial sequence number that is assigned to the first byte as 1, 2, 3, 4. So somewhere here we'll be having 1, 2, 3, 4, 1234. Okay. Now this is assigned as sequence number to first byte of data. Second byte of data will get sequence number of 1, 2, 3, 5, 1235. Third byte will get 1236. Okay. And so on. Now we are going to use all of these sequence numbers after some time. Okay. Bytes will keep on consuming these sequence numbers. After this last sequence, is, uh, sequence number is consumed, we will just wrap around. Okay. Again, we will start from zero only. Okay. And after some time, when all of these sequence numbers are also used, we are going to reuse this sequence number. Okay. The question is how much time is taken after which this one will be reused. So if you start from here, you will use all the sequence numbers once. That means in simple words, they are asking in how much time all the 2 raised to the power 32 sequence numbers will be consumed. That's it. Okay. Now every byte gets a sequence number. Let us find out in how much time these many bytes can be transmitted. We can easily find that using bandwidth. Bandwidth is 1 Gbps. It is in bits. Let us convert it into bytes because TCP is byte oriented. Every byte will consume a sequence number. So convert this into bytes. You will get 1 upon 8 gigabytes per second. Okay. Now value of G is given as 10 raised to the power 9. Even if they don't mention it in the question, still in case of bandwidth, G is 10 raised to the power 9. Okay. Maybe I said minus 9, I don't remember. It is 10 raised to the power 9. Okay. And in case of amount of data or memory, the value of G will be 2 raised to the power 30. So don't take 2 raised to the power 30 here. Anyways, these many bytes of data can be transferred per second. So this is transferred in one second. One byte of data will be transferred in 8 upon 10 raised to the power 9 seconds. Okay and 2 raised to the power 32 bytes of data. They will be transferred in 2 raised to the power 32 multiplied by 8 upon 10 raised to the power 9 seconds. Okay. So 8 can be written as 2 raised to the power 3. If you multiply both of them, you are going to get 2 raised to the power 32 plus 3, which is 2 raised to the power 35. Okay, like this. Divided by 10 raised to the power 9 is left as it is. Okay, these many seconds. Now, 2 raised to the power 32 bytes will be transferred in these many seconds. Every byte will take one sequence number. That means if you start from here, 
टू रेज टू दावर थर्टी टू सीक्वेंस नंबर विल बी यूज इन दिस मच टाइम एंड अगेन यू हैव टू रिपीट दिस वन ओके सो दिस इज द आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन लेट अस जस्ट फाइंड इट्स वैल्यू दे वर आस्किंग अस टू राउंड राउंड ऑफ इट टू द नियरेस्ट एंड टीजर सो दिस इज टू रेज टू दावर थर्टी फाइव डिवाइडेड बाय टेन रेज टू दावर नाइन दिस इज थर्टी फोर पॉइंट थ्री फाइव नाइन इवन इफ इट्स नॉट विजिबल आई राइट इट थर्टी फोर पॉइंट थ्री फाइव नाइन you just round it off to the nearest integer and you will get 34 answer to this question is 34 seconds are required to reuse this sequence number okay